I give notice that on the next sitting day I will move that this House 1 notes that under New South Wales law a transgender person wishing to change their identification to accurately reflect their sex must first have undergone a sex affirmation procedure despite concerns being raised by LGBTI groups and the Australian Human Rights Commission. Two, notes that if sex affirmation surgery is completed overseas, a transgender person must obtain the signature of two medical professionals after an invasive examination countersigned by a Justice of the Peace. And three, calls on the Attorney General to investigate approaches in Western Australia, South Australia and the ACT, which acknowledge and reflect the complexity of experiences of transgender people. Thank you.